Hi everyone, today we will be discussing the lease finance business as a relevant activity in the ESR regulations in UAE. If you like our video, please click the like button and subscribe to our channel. A lease finance business is a business that offers credit or some sort of financing in return for a consideration, which means that some sort of income has to be earned from this activity. For that to happen, an interest needs to be charged for this credit or finance. A lease finance business normally includes providing loans, entering into finance leases, providing credit in the form of higher purchases, long-term credit plans, and any sort of financing agreements. It is important to note that this is applicable to both related and unrelated parties. In UAE, it is quite normal for businesses within the same group to extend loans to each other. So this would fall under the lease finance business if an interest portion is being charged. If there are processing fees and other charges which are involved other than interests, this would fall under the lease finance activity as well. Simply extending a payment term or even charging late payment interest to your customers would not be treated as a lease finance business. Let us now discuss some of the core income generating activities which need to be conducted in the UAE for a lease finance business. The first is agreeing to the funding terms, including the type of funding, amount, interest rates, securities if any, and any covenants. In the case of leasing, the business must also identify and acquire the assets that need to be leased. The business must have the authority to set the terms and duration of any financing or leasing. Another co-income generating activity is that the business must be able to monitor and revise these agreements as and when required. Finally, the business must be able to manage any risk which includes developing and implementing strategies to reduce or spread the risks. For ESR purposes, a lease finance business should report to the central bank or the relevant authorities under the free zones or financial free zones. It might be normal for a banking business, an insurance business or even an investment fund management business to be conducting a lease finance activity. In such a case, it is not required to report for lease finance business. This is in order to avoid for duplicate reporting. I hope this video helped you understand the lease finance business under the ESR regulations. Thank you all for listening.